Hi, Seattle. How are you holding up? I'm EJ Ko. I'm a poet and an author, and I am grateful to read you a poem, and it's for you. It's my love letter to you. It's called Happy. The sound of a poem. It starts with the footsteps of an ant over the log we sit on. We hold up steaming mugs and we commit our anxieties to the air for these anxieties to become air, warmer and fresher as they rise away. A prologue prolongs the holy word, light. There is light eschewed from our bodies in all places, a source of its own, highlighting our features with pale, observable lightness as it does to breasts and breath. The middle begins with rocks falling off a cliff face into the water. This is the argument against time that passes through our bodies, sinks to the bottom of what used to be, raging at the seconds, sweeter and more stale as they leave us. Crisis is shaped like an owl pellet we open together, the tiny bones, beaks, and fur. There is a little tooth, a puff of feather. The further we peel back the translucent layers, the more heaven is dimmed by our bright and curious joy. The solar system is a clock. It turns as we pull the tool, leave the linen, divide the diamond, christen the chrysanthemum, circle the sound, as we ourselves pull back into solace. We are witnesses of each other. Afterward, we are unconcealed Soon there is no difference between words and then things. We are beginning, we are elliptical. You ask me across the aisle of the market, eating your croquette, how can you make a poem happy?